Hello, everybody. Wow. <clears throat> Let us try that again. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of the Fizzcast. I am your host, Physic, and hello. I know it's been about a month or more than probably since I've uploaded, um, due to a couple of things. One being, um, everyone in my family was home for pretty much all of winter break, winter slash Christmas break, and it wasn't very private, to say the least. I, I have a small house for seven people to be in, so it's, it's rather difficult to find time to record without disturbance, at least. I mean, you can record, I guess, but there'll be sounds and whatever in the background, and the idea is this for the, the, the idea for this is to be sort of just one, you know, not overwhelming. You don't, you don't want to be overloaded in the works. Um, Anyway, yeah, that's one reason. Another reason is I really haven't been motivated to record because admittedly there were a couple times where I should have. I mean, no one was here. One of, one of those times is right now. Currently, I'm no one's here and I'm just able to do this freely without disturbance. And that's very nice. Um, but yeah, there, there, were, there were a couple of opportunities that presented itself and I, and I never never capitalized on it. Which I, I, I absolutely should have. But, oh well. I had fun in the moment. And, <laughs> I'm not disappointing 100,000 people. Uh, as deprivational as that may be. But, yes, alright. And thirdly, w I don't know, there was... Ah, oh, yes, okay, here's the thing. Um, My DaVinci Resolve, which is the editor that I use to just overlay a text box over audio... It needed an update, and it, my internet is not good at all. Like, really, really bad. And it would not be able to handle the update, quite frankly. Um, and I was stuck at home for two and a half weeks because of winter break, and so, and I, so I just, you know, I couldn't do anything. I was soft locked. Everything that went into that software crashed, and everything that came out of it was just a mess of jumble and lost, corrupted, everything. Um, I did end up getting that updated, and so that will be when I basically upload this alongside the footage that I did record and probably a couple that I record today. Um, and that should be good. I think that'll be a lot better than, uh, I guess, you know, making up for it is probably what I'm doing, just because I, I really do enjoy doing this, but Apparently, there's other things I enjoy doing more, or the things that, you know, when I'm caught up in them, I, I kind of just get into a rhythm. Now, I didn't go into this episode with any idea other than to recap what's been going on in the last month and to excuse why I've been missing, but I suppose that's a pretty good thing to do, getting caught up in something, getting into a rhythm, into a flow. I do that a lot and it's kind of a problem because the things that I do have this sort of addictive effect not that inherently the things I do are addictive but I am very much a completionist person when I get hooked on something I have to finish I have to find that stopping point I can't just up and leave in the middle of it unless ordered to do so <laughs> but it is very very difficult for me to just do something of my own fruition whenever I'm in the middle of something. And those some things can take a long time. Whether it is playing a game, or playing with my cats, or being tired. I don't know, man. You know, watching videos even. I've been into a lot of analog horror recently, which is very, very intriguing, and I recommend you give the genre a try if you haven't already. One of the ones that I've most recently gotten into that is just, you know, ooh, ugh, chills, is... The, um, n it's that Neptune thing, the, the one second. Gemini Home Entertainment, that's the one. It is very good, and I would highly recommend going out and giving it a watch, but only give it a watch if you are alone and at night, because then it has that just... Horrible, awful, terrible, chills up your spine, I'm not sleeping tonight, cover your feet with the covers effect. And that is genuinely 
I, that is genuinely something I love to see in that sort of genre. Um, but I should go into that another time. Anyway, uh, whether whether it is getting into something, some sort of rhythm, some sort of flow, it's just hard to escape. And even if you know that what you're doing at the time is trivial, then it's still difficult to stop, simply because you just think that, oh, I gotta do this now, or I won't be able to do it later. I have to capitalize on this opportunity right now. And I guess on the topic of games, it's especially hard to do with games that are limited in in, in things. Things that you have a certain amount of time to do. Events or... Events... (laughs) That's really all I got. Specifically time-related events that are going to be done in a couple days. And like, oh, got to get everything out of it that you can right now. And that is usually how, what I get caught up in. Is Oh, there's time. If I don't do it now, I won't be able to do it later. Um, so I'll just do it now. And then this other thing. Oh, you know, I could do it later. I could record later. Besides, not now. Not, now's not a really good time anyway. The cat's on my lap and this game is going. And my computer fan is... Already whirring up loud enough that it'll corrupt the audio. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's just addicting. Although I, do, I must mention that having a cat on your lap is one of the best things that can be experienced. <laughs> just a, a, a cat sleeping on your lap, distracting you from doing everything and anything that you should be doing in that moment. And yeah, that's about it. Of course. Unless you're, you know, you don't like cats, in which case, strange, and, or, you know, you're allergic, in which case, unfortunate, but, you know, just saying, get that out of the way, um, hmm, how else can I, what else can I say, sort of rhythm, flow state, what can I go off of that, something like, it can be good, yes, let's talk about the positive side of it, all, all this time I've been, elaborating on the negativity of getting caught up in something. But by all means, flow state is generally a positively connotated word. You hear it and you're like, oh, yeah, 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 you're, you're in the zone, you know? You're focused. And um, that's that can be a good thing. That absolutely can be a good thing, especially when it comes to just cracking down and doing something. And that is very, very good. Very, very good habit to have. Um... Because it's good to just, you know, take the time out of your day, out of whatever other thing that you're doing, and just crack down, get the work done so that you can enjoy whatever luxuries you decide to later. Um, Good work ethic. I'm going to need that. (laughs) I hope to maintain my abilities in stressing out two days before a project is due and then just grinding it out. Because I seem to be pretty all right at that. And that is what has led me to complete a fair few amount of projects. Because I do have that ability to just block everything else out and just go. You know, just pedal to the metal. Gotta get this done tonight or I am screwed sort of thing. Um, and I feel like even in my mind that's an over-exaggeration. Because when I, when I do end up having that sort of flow state, it's about a week and a half before I should be stressed. But I'm stressed anyway. Um, so it ends up being good for me in the long run. Cause then I get, you know, I get that week and a half to work on other things, you know? Um, but yeah, that flow state can be a good thing. Of course, it providing you utilize it correctly. If you have that flow state in a game that is absolutely menial and just mindless, banal, you know, it, it's something you should probably rip yourself away from for a second and, and get something done. But you know, not everything is like that, especially especially amongst games, because time spent having fun is not time wasted. Um, but there is a point where you must recognize that, you know, this, this has to be done, and just crack down, go at it, right on, champ. Um, that's kind of what I'm doing right now, honestly. I plan on recording three or so episodes, and then I have a fourth one in the hard drive that I'm probably just going to splurge upload on one day to make sh- make you know make up for things, um, and see what happens. You know, see what happens. Go along with it. All right. I'm glad that the food staved off my cats long enough that they didn't interrupt the recording, which by all means is fine, but you know, inconvenient. Um, 
but glad that happened. Got a smooth recording out of it. I'm sure rambling is rambling is inevitable with me and being tangential, but it, it's kind of just the point of the channel <laughs> at this point. I don't I don't stay on a topic for very long, so prepare to hear about everything when you're here. I you know, I guess that's it. I don't want to spoil too much or waste too much brain juice going off on other ideas, but Yes, thank you very much for joining me on this episode of the FizzCast. I will see you when I see you. Bye-bye.